delighted to be here today for the Meet the Experts event. We're in our £33 million Spark building. So my talk today at the event was about resistance training um, and how it might help to improve endurance performance. People should incorporate some element of resistance training or strength training into their training program. Um, it helps reduce injuries, it makes people stronger, more resilient, um, and that makes them better able to specifically practice and train for the actual event that they're interested in performing in. We, we, we talked a lot about foam rolling and stretching uh, and I think the key message is that the two of them should be combined. Um, in isolation they're both okay but they work much better when you foam roll before stretching um, and if people know that they've got an area of tightness or uh, pain or discomfort when they foam roll it's that area that they should focus on um, and then perform some stretching straight away after it after they've hopefully alleviated that discomfort. Hydration is something that tends to be overlooked, so make sure that you're properly hydrated before you go training and then also on race day as well. But equally it's really important to make sure that you don't overhydrate, so don't feel that every time there's a water station that you have to take some water, it's about working out what's right for you. The mission of Southampton Solent University is very closely aligned to the mission of ABP Southampton Marathon because we're about enabling people to make the most of opportunities and to provide a structured way to get there.